with weatherbug.com meteorologist Addison Green here with your latest forecast on this fine Friday and in which case portions of Minnesota will continue to dry out from the huge amount of water they saw come out of the sky yesterday during the wee morning hours. The flash flooding was a big problem around the Twin Cities metro area and the Minnehaha Falls and Minnehaha Creek clearly showing all that excess runoff and how it looks looking making the falls look like more like Niagara Falls and uh, yeah there's going to be more rainfall coming across portions of the upper Midwest as well as the Ohio River Valley as we're going to see an area of low pressure move across the Ohio River Valley region and isolated showers and thunderstorms across come across the upper Midwest. Going in towards Saturday's time frame, high pressure will be protecting much of the Great Lakes, the Northeast, and pushing in towards the Mid-Atlantic areas with spectacles of showers coming down across the classic plain states. The West Coast looks pretty much tranquil, nice and pleasant. Along the front range of the Rockies, however, you could get some scattered showers and thunderstorms for Sunday afternoon and more thunderstorms lining up along a cold front as it swings on through the region and the central plains once again under the risk for dealing with some strong storms. Here's your chance for seeing severe weather. Yellow highlighted zone across northern Minnesota is out there for today. Then as you're going towards Saturday, we see a slight risk for severe weather from South Dakota all the way in towards Illinois. And then moving in towards Sunday's time frame, we're looking at more general chance for thunderstorms right now, but we could see those storms get a little bit unsettled later on. And when all is said and done, yeah, more rainfall coming out across the central portion of the country one to two inches of rainfall plus in most regions. And there's going to be ample amounts of moisture as well. Dew points will be on the rise to the 60s and 70s across the plain states. Coming in out of the Gulf of Mexico will be that moisture. The West Coast looks pretty much pleasant. So does the Northeast, not dealing with that high humidity like they had before. Speaking of the Northeast, New York City is 80 degrees in the sunny skies. He's in Minneapolis, 85. Thunderstorms in Dallas, high of 91.